All right, Simmons, I'm gonna show you where we keep the baddest of the bad inmates. Solitary confinement. There's no food, there's no electricity, there's no hope. Well, what do they eat if they don't have food, sir? They eat cockroaches and rats and whatever else they can find on the ground. Okay, so this is our first inmate, Bubbles. What's up, beautiful? Back away from the bars. Oh, wait, you afraid to get kissed, huh? Don't kiss him, Simmons. I didn't plan on it, sir. One kiss from him and you'll fall in love. Yeah, welcome to my love chamber. Come on in. Come on, Simmons, let's go. What, what, come on, kiss me. Kiss me. Come on, come on. All right, Simmons, follow me this way. Oh, no, hurry up, hurry up. All right, Simmons, this next inmate is the worst of the worst. Her name is Nancy. Can I see what she looks like? Oh, of course you can. She's a caged animal. Hey, Nancy, get out here, you old bag. N Nancy? She's coming. N Nancy? N Nancy, D don't make me come in there and pull you out. You're making me look bad. <laughs> Nancy, you old kook. Just one second, Simmons. Nancy, you're pissing me off. Let me come and grab you. Nancy? Nancy, you better be dead in here because you didn't answer me. What? Oh my god! Oh no, she escaped! Simmons! Simmons, sound the alarms! Nancy escaped! We got a cold red! Lock down the prison! Go, go, go! <laughs> Today's gonna be a good day. Let's see what we got here. She's perfect. Uh, let's go get some kids. Now where are those kids at? Hmm. Maybe some musical help. Oh, kids! Where are you, kids? I got some free candy for you, kids! Ugh, I did it. I finally escaped. And on Jeffy's 18th birthday. Now all I gotta do is kidnap him and get my millions of dollars. Now where the hell am I? Ugh. Oh, God. I'm so glad to finally be out of that prison. Oh. oh shit, it's the cops! Wait, wait a minute, that's not the cops. Maybe, maybe he'll give me a ride. Woohoo! Oh, yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo, big boy, can you give me a ride? I don't think he's stopping! Stop! Hey there, baby. You really shouldn't stand in the road. I almost hit you. Can you give me a ride, big boy? No, I only take kids. Oh, really? Well, there's a kid I need you to help me take. Sorry, I work alone. I'll give you $50,000. <laughs> That'll buy me a lot of candy. Get in. Chief, Chief, Chief! Don't worry, guy, I didn't forget today's your birthday. <gasps> Chief, you remembered my birthday! Happy birthday, guy. I didn't know it was your birthday, mate. Yes, Simmons, today's my birthday. At least somebody remembered. Well, happy birthday! That's too late now. So what were you gonna tell me, guy? Huh, I don't even remember, I'm just so happy now. The prisoner escaped! Oh yeah, the prisoner escaped. <gasps> Chief, the prisoner Nancy escaped from solitary confinement. We locked down the entire prison, but she still somehow got away. Damn it, guy, how could you allow this to happen? Sir, I don't know what happened. She dug her way through concrete. I don't know how, it was like some Shawshank Redemption shit. Damn it, guy, you better bring her back dead or alive or you're fired. Sir, you can't fire me, today's my birthday. Then I'll wait till tomorrow and then fire your ass. Well, you can't fire me, cause I quit. I'm just kidding. You know I need this job. Come on, Simmons, let's go find him. All right, Marvin, is this good enough? I think we need a few more balloons. A few more balloons? I bought all the balloons! 
balloons from the store. I just want to make sure that Jeffy's 18th birthday is special. <gasps> Marvin, this looks amazing. You did this just for Jeffy's birthday? You know me. I love Jeffy, and I want to make sure his 18th birthday is the most special birthday he's ever had. That's so sweet, Marvin. Jeffy's going to be so excited. Hey, Chef PB, can you go to the store and get 50 more balloons? 50 more balloons? <laughs> I'll get your stupid balloons. Now leave me alone. I just want to make sure that Jeffy gives me money. I mean, uh, I want to make sure that Jeffy knows I love him. Marvin, you're not doing this just because Jeffy's inheriting millions of dollars from his dead father, are you? Jeffy's inheriting millions of dollars from his dead father? It completely slipped my mind. Oh, really? I'm being serious, baby. You know I love Jeffy. I mean, it's his 18th birthday. Marvin, come on. Just let him enjoy his special day. Baby, it is our special day because he's turning 18 and he can move out of the house. Marvin, we're not kicking him out of the house on his birthday. It depends on how much money he gives us. Marvin! Oh, listen, let me go wake up Jeffy because it's his birthday and let me get his king crown. King crown? Hey. Hey. My snore in Russian. Jeffy, hey. wake up. It's your birthday. Really, Daddy? Yeah, Jeffy, you're 18 years old. <laughs> Yeah, that too. So how about you take off that bunny suit and come downstairs? But what if I don't want to take off my bunny suit? Then leave it on. You can keep it on all day. Really, Daddy? You never let me leave my bunny suit on all day. Well, it's your birthday, so you can do whatever you want. And look, for breakfast, I got you candy bars. <gasps> candy for breakfast? Daddy, you're being really nice to me today. Well, you know I love you, Jeffy. I wouldn't be doing it for any other reason. And look, since it's your birthday, is there anything else you want? Strippers. But you want one? Yeah, with big yummy cans. Well, I'll call one up for your birthday party, which is downstairs. Whoa, I got a birthday party? Do I have chocolate and cake? Of course there's chocolate cake, buddy. <laughs> So how about you go downstairs? Wait, wait, wait a second. You're now king of the house. I totally forgot you're king of the house. King of the house? So here is your birthday crown. You can tell people what to do. Oh, well then I banish you to the dungeon. Well, don't banish me yet until you see how cool your birthday party is. Okay, let's go see it. Come on. All right, I'm going to take off my bunny suit and put my birthday suit on. Well, don't get naked. How about you just take the bunny suit off? Come on. Here it is. Here's Jeffy's cake. All right, Jeffy. Here's your birthday party. <gasps> Daddy, look at all your balloons. Wait, uh, Chef Baby, where's the 50 extra balloons? They were sold out. I just got the cake. Wait, go get some more balloons. Go find some. Drive a hundred miles to go get some. Get I'll some. find the balloons. Go get some. It's Jeffy Dixie's birthday party. I want it to be special. <gasps> Dang, this is the coolest birthday ever. It's a birthday fit for a king. Yes, Jeffy, and look at all your presents full of expensive items, and maybe one day you'll repay us like today. Marvin. Which one has the stripper in it? Uh, she's on the way. What? That's what Jeffy wanted for his birthday party. No, Marvin. Hey, Dang, since I'm 18 now, can I throw this glass cup against the wall and shatter it? I mean... I'd rather you didn't, but if that's what you want to do on your birthday party, then go for it, buddy, but please don't. Hmm, I've suddenly grown out of childish behavior. Wait, really? No. Oh, well, uh, you know, that doesn't even make me mad because it's your birthday party, so just go go crazy, Jeffy. There's someone at the door. Stripper? Wait, no, not yet. I I'm about, I'm, I'm, she, uh, it's your friends. Oh, my friends! Jeffy, your friends are here. Happy birthday, Jeffy! Yeah, happy birthday. Happy birthday, dude. This party's so crazy. Thanks, guys. Look, I'm a king. Oh, wow, that crown is so cool. And you're 18 years old? That means strippers. Bye. Yeah, you can also vote now. What? Well, he can. You can also buy an assault rifle. Gun laws are so crazy. I'm going to hide when you turn 18. See that house right there? Yep. That's where the kid lives. What does he look like? He's got a blue helmet and a yellow shirt that says Jeffy on it. You can't miss him. It's his birthday, so he's probably got a party going on. All right. What I'll do is I'll just go up to the house and pretend I'm there for the birthday party. And when I see him, I'll grab him and bring him back to the van. Good thinkings. So, Jeffy, what are you going to do for your 18th birthday? I might eat cake, I might stick my wiener in an amp pile, the possibilities are endless! I'm really digging your LGBT birthday napkins, super homo. Yeah, super, dude. Thanks for giving us a shot. No problem, Cody. <laughs> Jeffy, there's someone at the door. Stripper? Maybe. Hello? Hey, I'm here to see the birthday boy. We didn't hire a clown. Well, someone did. Who? Listen, man, I don't ask questions. I just do what I'm told. I'm here to eat cake, make snake balloons, and snort blow. Uh, I mean, a, a clown would make Jeffy's birthday party really cool. It sure would. So come on inside. Planned on it. Jeffy, there was a special guest at the door. Was he the stripper? No, it was a clown. Now, wait a minute. I can strip, too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
Stop that. We don't need that. Oh, yes, we do. Keep going. Stop that. What? Just focus on making animal balloons. Oh, darn. I left my balloons out in my van. Which one of you kids wants to come out to my van with me and get the balloons? Ooh, I will. No, I really think the birthday boy should come with me. No, the birthday boy needs to stay here and open his gifts. No, I really think the birthday boy should come out to the van with me. No, get one of the other kids to do it. Listen, bub, I'm taking this kid with me whether you like it or not. No, you're not going to talk like that. I didn't even hire a clown, so you need to leave. Just get out of here. Come on. Oh, rats. Go on. Get, get out of here. Hey, 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 listen, 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 listen. What? I'm sorry. Get out of here. Oh, damn it. I got to get that kid. What What happened? Where's Jeffy? He didn't want to come to the van. His dad said no. What, why would you tell him about the goddamn van? Nobody's willingly going to get into a van that says free candy on it, goddammit. Listen, he's yelling at me. You're yelling at me. It's hurting my feelings. Well, what are we going to do now? How are we going to get Jeffy? No, hold on. I'm thinking of something. Well, think faster. Oh, you know what? I got it. Hold on. I'll be back with the kid. Jeffy, are you ready to hit your pinata? I have a pinata? Yeah, it's waiting for you outside, Jeffy. Oh, I'm about to whack that shit. A pinata? That's so crazy. All right, kids, everyone outside to hit the pinata. Yay! All right, Jeffy, hit your pinata and make all the candy come out. Shouldn't he be blindfolded? No, it's Jeffy's 18th birthday. And we want to make sure he gets all the candy, so hit it, Jeffy. Stand back, everyone. Yeah, because I'm about to go ape shit on this horsey. Take this horsey! Ah! All right, here's the kid. This van is so crazy. This lollipop hurts to eat. What? Who the hell is this? Where's Jeffy? I thought this was the kid. No, I said blue helmet, yellow shirt. Oh, I thought you said blue shirt, no helmet. What, what are you, knocking futs? This is the wrong kid. It is? Yes, now we gotta kill him so he doesn't tell on us. Why would I tell on you? This van is cool. <sighs> okay, listen, kid. You get out of this van and you run and you don't stop running. Okay, I love running. Well, what do we do now? <sighs> okay, since you can't do it right, I have an idea. Now pull the van around in front of their house. All right. All right, kids. Did everyone get some candy? Yeah. All right, Jeffy. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to put candles on your cake and sing you happy birthday. Can you sing me happy birthday 18 times since it's my 18th birthday? Yeah, Marvin. You did say anything for Jeffy's birthday. Uh, I mean... 18's a lot of times. You sure you want 18? Yes. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, we'll sing it 18 times. And can everyone dress up like me? But why would we dress up like you, Jeffy? Because it's my birthday and it would be fun if everyone dressed up like me. <sighs> All right, everyone. Go put on a yellow shirt and a blue helmet to look like Jeffy, I guess. Come on, baby, let's go dress up like Jeffy. This is the coolest birthday ever. Everyone loves me. I can't believe I'm doing this. I look ridiculous. Baby, hurry up. Aw, Marvin, it's just too big on me. Baby, it looks like a dress. Look, we have to dress up like Jeffy to make him happy on his birthday. You really want that money, huh? But baby, I already told you this isn't about the money. I would do this for anyone on their birthday. You would do it for me on my birthday? Well, I mean, listen, baby, it's not about the money. Breaking news, okay? World-renowned painter, Jacques-Pierre Francois, the famous painter we all presumed was dead, turns out he's actually still alive. He faked his death to make his paintings more valuable. I have an exclusive interview with him now. All right, everyone. I'm here with the now-alive world-renowned painter, Jacques-Pierre Francois. So tell us, Jacques, why would you fake your own death? Uh, you see, paintings are worth more when the artist is dead, and I was drowning and gambling debts. So I fake my own death, and now my paintings are worth millions. Extraordinary. But how did you fake your death? You jumped off the bridge and we saw the splattered remains on the canvas. Oh, that was quite simple. All I had to do was push a pig off the bridge, and when it splatters on the canvas, the body was unrecognizable. And I bought that painting for $200 million, and now that you're not dead, that painting's not worth fuck! That is, as you Americans say, too bad, so sad. I'm gonna slap that stupid little pipe cleaner mustache clean off your stupid face. Don't hate me because you ain't me. Well, what about your son? He was supposed to inherit your multi-million dollar fortune. Ah, uh, yes, the boy. Listen, son, if you are watching this, look into the camera. Look at your papa. Fuck off. Well, you heard it here first, folks. I'm out $200 million. I will now celebrate my millions by eating one of your American hamburgers from the McDonald King. Oh, wow, Marvin. Good thing it wasn't about the money. Otherwise, you'd be really upset right now, huh? He's not getting any of the money! I'm taking a Jeffy off and I'm the cake away and pop it out of the balloon! And you said it wasn't about the money! Of course it was about the money! You think I would take care of it for years for free? Marvin, we love 
Jeffy. I don't, you might, but I don't. I definitely don't. He's got so much hell in my life. He's broke stuff. I want him gone. Jeffy would be really upset right now if he heard the awful things you were saying. I'm very upset for the things I heard on the news. I thought we were going to get money, baby. I thought we were going to get be paid. That wasn't even your money. That was Jeffy's money. I thought he was going to give us some. I thought he was going to be like, hey, hey, Marvin, uh, sorry for screwing your life over the last few years. Here's a, here's a quick milli. It's quick milli cash. You honestly think Jeffy was going to share? Yes, I thought he gave a shit. I, I am so mad. I'm going to go throw his cake away. I'm taking that damn king crown off his head. I'm only singing him happy birthday once. Marvin, you're going to sing happy birthday to him 18 times on his birthday. Let's go. No, the only 18 thing that's happening is how old he's turning because he's out of the house. No, we're, Marvin, you don't mean that. We're kicking him out of the house. You think I'm going to deal with him for free. He's not going to live with us till he's 30 or 40. I'll kill myself. Listen, I am going to go tell Jeffy that he is gone when he leaves his house. Uh, we, we can see him happy birthday once, but I'm taking that crown. We're gone. Stop right here. Stop right here. All right, what's the plan? Okay, we're going to roll the windows down, and then you're going to play some silly music so the kids think you're an ice cream truck. And then when the kids come out to get their free candy, you're going to grab Jeffy, and I'm going to jump in the driver's seat and speed off. That's a good idea. I wish I would have thought about that. All right, roll your window down. Free candy, kids! Okay, Jeffy, we're dressed up just like you. Yeah, even Ken. Oh, that's sick. It's like I'm Gru and you guys are my minions. We got to get the girl another unicorn toy. You guys hear that? It sounds like an ice cream truck. Ooh, ice cream? I want ice cream. Mother effing ice cream truck! This birthday is the tips. Let's go. Guys, I can't believe it. A free candy van. What a dream come true. I hope they have Starburst. Ooh, they better have Snickers, dude. I want M&M's. Guys, doesn't this seem a little suspicious? How? Well, it's a white van with free candy spray painted on it. That's like typical kidnapper stuff. Cody, nobody kidnaps people anymore. That's illegal. Yeah, there's cameras everywhere, dude. Yeah, nobody's gonna go to jail for kidnapping. Uh, okay, okay, yeah. I guess you guys are right. This isn't sketchy at all. Cody, let's just go get our free candy and shut up. Oh, here they come. All the kids are coming. Good. Now you tell the kids they have to go to the back to get the candy, and then you grab Jeffy and I'll speed off. All right, get it. All right, Jeffy, let's hurry up and sing happy birthday, and then you're getting the hell out of the house. Where Jeffy? Where's Jeffy? Where's all the kids at? Uh, uh, Marvin, I couldn't find any more balloons at the store. Don't yell at me. I don't care. We don't need any more balloons. Wait, seriously? Well, you wanted balloons earlier. I don't care about this party. I don't care about these balloons. We don't need anything. Thank God. Do you know where the kids are at, Chef PB? Uh, I think they're outside at the ice cream truck getting ice cream. Ice cream truck? Yeah, you don't hear it? What? Uh, we want candy. Yeah, do you have Skittles? Oh, do you have three musketeers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have all the musketeers and mouse tools. So just if you want candy, meet me at the back of the van. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Guys, this is getting worse. How? He wants us to meet him at the back of the van. Yeah, that's where he stores all his candy. You see how big this van is? Oh, dude, just shut up. Oh, okay, but if somebody gets kidnapped, don't come crying to me about it. Come on. Candy, 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 candy. Who wants candy? We do. Oh, please look for the sneakers first. All right, let me see if I got it. Nope, no Snickers. Aw, oh, man. What other candy would you kids want? Uh, do you have Starburst? What, what, what the? Hey, hey, what are you doing here? Just go away, Jeffy. Nope, no Starburst. Aw. Do you have circus peanuts? Let me check. Hurry up and grab them, damn it. All right. They all look the same, though. What are you kids doing, uh, Jeffy? All you kids go inside right now. Hey, oh, God, what oh, are you doing? God, oh, God. Look me. Ah, I don't fight. I'm going to burn them. There, all the candles are lit. I can't believe we didn't get any ice cream. Or candy. I don't even think they had candy. Jeffy, are you ready to blow out your birthday candles? Yeah, are you guys gonna sing happy birthday to me 18 times? Of course, Jeffy, but wait, where's Marvin? Oh, he was outside and he yelled at us to come inside and said we couldn't have any candy. Oh yeah, he's in a bad mood, Jeffy. But he's been in a good mood all day. I know, but I think he has a headache or something. Are you ready to sing happy birthday to Jeffy? Yeah. yeah. All right, ready? Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Jeffy, happy birthday to you, again, again, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you. Jeffy, blow out the candles! Oh. Yay! So
So, Jeffy, did you like your birthday today? Well, you guys had me in the first half, not gonna lie. But the second half blew major donkey balls. What was wrong with the second half? Well, for starters, all the presents downstairs were just empty boxes wrapped with wrapping paper, and Daddy ran away. Well, you know, Jeffy, I think your dad's going through a midlife crisis today. Today? Of all days? Maybe he's at the store getting you real presents since your gift bags were empty. We can only hope. Well, do you want to watch some TV, Jeffy? Ooh, well, since I'm 18 now, can we watch naughty shows? I'm talking full frontal. No, Jeffy, let's watch the news. Uh. Breaking news! A prisoner in a maximum security prison has escaped. Please be on the lookout for this woman pictured here. Her name is Nancy. Real mommy escaped from prison? Uh, Jeffy, let's watch something else. Nudity? No, Jeffy. Mommy, what if real mommy comes and tries to kidnap me? We wouldn't let that happen. You promise? I promise. Okay, good. Um, now where's Marvin? I'm gonna give him a call. Nipple time! Jeffy, change the channel. Mommy, look at these rocking cans. Jeffy, change the channel now. Jeffy, stop it. Oh, he didn't answer. Well, he's missing a good show. Jeffy, I'm changing the channel. No. <sighs> okay, let me see Jeffy. He's right here. He is mommy. Wait a minute. What? what are you guys doing? Let me go. This isn't Jeffy. Sure it is. See the blue helmet and the yellow shirt? No, no, no. This isn't Jeffy. This is somebody else with a blue helmet and yellow shirt. <sighs> Listen, this is too hard. Can we try something easier? Wait, wait. You're Jeffy's mom. Wait a minute. You're the bozo who put me in jail. Well, no, no. You put yourself in jail, but I had nothing to do with it. Okay, look. I don't want you. I wanted Jeffy so I could take his millions of dollars that I rightly deserve. Well, good luck getting that money because his dad's not dead. He's actually alive and he's not giving Jeffy any of the money. <laughs> nice try. You really expect me to believe that? Wait, it's on the news. Just turn it on. Yeah, right. You'll say anything to get me to let you go. No, I have a better idea for you. I'm going to hold you hostage until Jeffy gives me that money. He doesn't have the money. Well, if he doesn't give me the money, you're dead. <laughs> hey, can I use your phone? Sure. I got to call his family. All right, what's Jeffy's number? Jeffy's number? Why do you need his number? Because I'm going to call Jeffy and you're going to tell him you're kidnapped and that you're going to die if he doesn't give me that money. He's not going to believe me. Well, we're going to try anyway. Oh, okay, his, his number is... I'm changing the channel, yeah. Jeffy! No, you're not! I've waited 18 years to watch shows like this! You're not going to take this from me! You can wait a little longer! Wait, wait, wait! My phone's ringing. Maybe it's Marvin! No, it's not my phone. Yeah, it's my phone. Yo, you have reached the plug. Please, Shibby. Shibby. Go on, talk. Uh, Jeffy, it's it's me. Say Shibby. What? Say Shibby. Uh, Shibby. Wait, what was that? Was it some kind of code? No, he told me to do that before I talked. I, just say what I told you, damn it. Uh, uh, hey, Jeffy, it's, it's me, Marvin. Uh, I was kidnapped. Sorry, wrong number. What? Who was that, Jeffy? It was some salesman trying to sell me a car's extended warranty. But you don't have a car. Exactly why I hung up on him. Aw, you're so smart, Jeffy. I don't know. What'd he say? Uh, he thought it was a wrong number. Oh, damn it, make him believe you or I'll shoot you in the head. Oh, yeah, call my wife, call my wife. Okay. Hi, 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 Jeffy, hi, hold hi, on, my hi. phone's ringing. It's a blocked number, hello? Talking no funny business. Uh, hey, baby. Marvin, where are you? Why are you calling from a blocked number? Oh, it's a long story, so I got- Oh my god, are you calling from a side chick's phone? What side chick would I have? Listen, baby, look, I'm kidnapped, and they want millions of dollars, so can you- Marvin, is this your sick way of trying to make money because Jeffy's dad really isn't dead? Wait, he's not? But baby, no, I'm not trying to make money. I, I can't believe you abandoned Jeffy on his birthday. You're a deadbeat dad. But no, I'm kidnapped. I didn't abandon- I guess just come home whenever you feel like it. No, hang up. Okay, what'd she say? Uh, she thinks I'm a deadbeat dad and I left Jeffy on his birthday. Oh, God damn it! that's it, I'm killing him, get my gun. Oh, no, 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 don't get the gun, oh, okay, how about one of you call him, because you guys have scary voices, so who has the scarier voice? She does. Okay. Mommy, is my real dad really alive? Yes, he is, Jeffy. Well, I want to meet him. No, I don't think you do. Just don't watch the news. No, I want to meet him because I bet real daddy wouldn't leave me at my own birthday party. I don't know about that, Jeffy. Wait, my phone's ringing. I bet it's Marvin. What do you want, Marvin? If you ever want to see Marvin again, you'll give me $5 million. Wait, this isn't Marvin. No, it's not. And if you ever want to see Marvin again, give me $5 million. What's going on? Okay, I kidnapped Marvin, and if you want to see him again, you will give me five million dollars. But I don't have five million dollars. Well, then I guess you're not going to see Marvin again. What, should I kill him now? No, don't do that. Um, I'll just call you back in five minutes. What? Oh, 
Okay. Wait, but uh, you called from a block number, so I don't have your number. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Uh, what, what is your number? Mine? No, the guy who's tied up. What's his number? What? No, I was being sarcastic. Yes, your number. Well, then you should have said something. You should have said, hey, Screwball, what's your phone number? Hey, Screwball. What? What is your phone number? 555-555-5556. It's... It's all fives with the six at the end. You can't screw it up. Okay, I'll, I'll call back in five minutes, okay? Jimmy, your dad's been kidnapped! Which one? Uh, Marvin! Oh, well, good. He deserved it. He left me at my own birthday party. Oh, I'm gonna call the cops. What'd they say? They're gonna call me back. But if they don't call me back in five minutes, I'm killing you. Uh, oh, they're gonna call back. Hey there, somebody call the cops? And I brought backup, because in case you haven't heard, there's a goon on the loose. And she's a real rascal, that goon. So have you seen any goons? What about you, kid? You look like you've seen a goon or two. That goon kidnapped my husband. It's the woman that escaped from prison that was on the news. I'm sorry, what? The woman on the news that escaped from prison. See, see, I just distinctly didn't hear you say happy birthday to the birthday boy. Oh, is it your birthday today? Nobody loves me. I'm so sorry. It's just, it's my son's birthday today, so. Oh, yeah. God, I hate people who have the same birthday as me. I wish they'd all die. Can we focus here, please? This woman kidnapped my husband. She's asking for $5 million or so she's going to kill him. Wait, you were contacted by the woman who escaped from prison? You hear that, Simmons? We have a lead. We have a lead? We have a lead. So where is she? I don't know. She called from a blocked phone number. A blocked phone number. We lost the lead. We lost the lead. We, we lost the lead. But she did give me her phone number. She gave you a phone number? She gave you a phone number? She, she gave you her phone number. number. Okay, great. So we can just call her. So we can just call her. So we no, no, can... Simmons, Simmons, stop. Stop singing. It's starting to piss me off. Okay, so we can just call her and hear her demands. Yes, but I already told you her demands. She wants $5 million or she's going to kill Marvin. Hey, listen. You've never met a negotiator him like me. I can get that price way down. You should have seen me get my Hyundai Sonata. I got them to take five grand off the sticker. Oh man, it was great. Hey, you, you want to ride in my Hyundai Sonata? No, please, can we just focus and no, call come this on, woman? You gotta take a ride in my Sonata. Come on. There she is. That's my baby. It's very nice. Now, can we it please? It is very nice. I insist you take a ride in her. No, that's not necessary. Can we please oh, go it's call? it's very necessary. When you feel the seats are going to be in heaven. I'll take your word for it. Please, oh, let's go call. Oh, you don't have to take my word for it. Come on, let's take a ride. Ugh. Oh man, I love being in this car. It's way more comfy than the cop car, which I have to go get in soon. Yes, this car's very impressive. Now can we please this go back? This car has so many features. Like, check this out. Yes. You're gonna love this. You know what that is? That's a blind spot camera. So if some little brat tries running up on me while I'm turning, I can see him. It's very convenient. Can we go back inside yeah, and, I and call? Yeah, I got all of these features for a steal at the Hyundai Sunday sales event. I'm so happy for you. Can we please go call Jeffy's? I Jeffy? think we should take a quick little ride around the neighborhood. No! Yeah, come on, come on, you'll love it. Oh. oh, man, how lucky are you? You get to ride in my Sonata. Not a lot of people get to do that. Not even my daughter, you know, because she eats crackers and the crumbs get between the seats. Oh, big mess. Can we please? Huge mess. Can we please? And then you got to get in there with a vacuum, and that takes forever, and it's Can loud. we please? And then you got to pay the vacuum with quarters, and that just sucks. Can we please call the woman now? Oh, yeah, we can call it. Just hold on. <sighs> it's ringing. Hello? Hey there, ma'am. I just wanted to let you know that this is the police and you're going to jail, bitch. <laughs> Say hi, Simmons. Hi, Simmons. No, Simmons, you're supposed to... Just call her a bitch. Bitch! You hear that? That's my buddy Simmons, and he's gonna kick your ass. I sure am! Yeah, he'll hit a woman. He doesn't care. I don't care! He doesn't care. Oh, no, you're not, because I got a hostage. Oh, man, I hate when they have hostages. What do you want? I want five million dollars. You're gonna meet me in the field. Y you know the one. Oh, yeah, of course I know the field. It's the field. It's the one field. You're gonna meet me in the field in an hour with five million dollars and Jeffy, because I want to say hi to him. Uh, okay, okay, but, but hear me out. How about three million dollars? No, it's five million dollars or I kill this guy right now. Oh, damn, you're not playing, so I don't get the Hyundai Sunday sales event price? No. Uh, okay. Simmons, when we get there, we're gonna shoot her in the face. And no weapons! Oh, come on, that's not fair! So do we have a deal? <sighs> okay, stupid. I didn't get anything out of that phone call. I'm sorry, mate. What did she say? She wants us to meet her in the field in an hour with $5 million and Jeffy. But we don't have $5 million! Yeah, I know. So when she gets there, you and I are just gonna tackle her. I mean, it's two against one and she's had no weapons, so I think we can take her. Yeah. Come on, Jeffy, let's go see her. So what's happening? We're gonna meet the cops and Jeffy in an hour to trade you for the money. Yes, Screwball? Why would we meet with the cops? Wouldn't they just shoot us? No, because I told them no weapons. Oh, that's smart. But guess who's gonna bring their gun? Who? Me! Well, that's not fair. Shouldn't you tell them so it's fair? No, I don't care if it's fair. Come on, we're going. Okay.
Okay, Simmons, I'm assuming they're in the van that says free candy on it. Oh, mate, you think we can get some free candy? I don't think they have any free candy, Simmons. Well, why would they put it on the van if it's not true? I'm gonna take a wild guess and say it's so they can kidnap people. But that's illegal! I know, and that's why we're gonna arrest them. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get out of the van and we're gonna play good cop. We're gonna be like, hey, we got your money, and then bam, we whoop her ass. And then we save Marvin, we get the key to the city, and the chief is gonna give us promotions. Sounds good, mate. All right, Jeffy, you stay here. All right, bitch, we're here. Oh, God damn it. Oh, right, no, Simmons, I'm not all right. I closed the door in my hand. Did you go to the hospital? No, we're doing this. Hold on. Okay, look, we brought your money, and we didn't bring any weapons. <laughs> well, I did bring a weapon, so show me the money or I'm going to blow his head off. That's not fair. That's not fair. That's, That's not, not fair. fair. We said no weapons. We were going to beat your ass. <laughs> you really thought I was stupid enough not to bring a gun? Now show me the money, or I'm going to shoot him and all. <laughs> well, you see, it's actually kind of a funny story because we didn't bring the money because me and Simmons thought we could beat you up. All right, that's it. I'm killing him. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't shoot him. We, we have Jeffy in the back of the car. You wanted him, right? Okay. Hand over Jeffy. Uh, Jeffy, could you come out of the car? Hey, Mommy. Jeffy, run. Hey, Jeffy. Mommy missed you. Now come to Mommy. Go. <laughs> hey, at least we saved Marvin, right? Go on, Jeffy. Oh. Well, you're not gonna let her take Jeffy, are you? We don't have any weapons, bro. I don't know what you want us to do. Hey, Jeffy. Happy birthday. <laughs> okay, since you didn't bring my money, I'm taking Jeffy with me. And whenever you want to stop playing games, maybe we can make another deal. Come on. Oh, Daddy, help me. She took him. She really just took him. I mean, hey, at least you don't have to deal with him anymore. Well, I know, but like, I don't want anything bad to happen to him. Why? What do you care? You were always complaining about him anyway. Well, I know, I just, I still care about him. Yeah, I mean, look on the bright side. At least it's a nice day for it. You know, it's not too hot, not too cold. You know, if my kid were to get kidnapped, I'd want it to be in weather like this. True. What are you guys gotta do something? Go out and chase the van! We can't do anything, man! We don't have any weapons, and she has a handgun. She could shoot all of us! Wait, mate, don't we have a sniper rifle in the trunk of the car? Oh, yeah, we do have a sniper rifle in the trunk of the car. Okay, Simmons, I want you to camp out somewhere. Get up in one of these trees and shoot out her tires. On it. Okay, Marvin, me and you are gonna chase that van down. Come on! Let's go! Ugh. Someone's gonna die today. All right, Marvin, you're about to see how I drove on my driver's test when I was 16. Poorly. I'm trying, man! Man, she is driving like crazy. I guess I can add reckless driving to the list of charges. You know, I can make corny cop puns because we're in a police chase. Let's just focus on the road! Okay! <laughs> Jeffy, I'm sick of you. I never loved you. You were an accident. After I get my money, I'm gonna kill you and bury you in the deepest hole I can find, and then I'm gonna kill your other fan. Daddy, help me! Ram her! You should ram her! Okay, I'm gonna do a pit maneuver! Yeah, go! Wait, 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 what's going on? What's going on? Wait, what's going on? Oh, shit! What? I ran out of gas! I ran out of gas? Well, she's getting away! Can we get more gas? Hmm, I don't see any gas stations in this fucking field, do you? Well, no, but she's getting away! It's up to Simmons now. Simmons, I need you to shoot those tires out right now! I'm on it, mate! Hold still, you bastard! Uh, Simmons? You are only supposed to shoot the tires. Whoops. Jeffy's dead. Uh, uh, uh d -d dispatch? We, we, we need we need an ambulance and a fire truck. Just, just, just all of it. Get out here now. Marvin? Oh my god, Marvin! Thank god you're okay and no one was hurt! Ooh, uh, Simmons, I think we should probably leave. Why? This is about to be really sad. Marvin, where's Jeffy? Uh, he's, uh... He's not coming back, baby. What do you mean he isn't coming back? Where is he? His, uh, his, his mom took him. No, she didn't. Marvin, we had to go back there. We had to go get him. Get the cops. No, he, he, he's dead, baby. He's dead? What are you talking about, Marvin? Listen, the mom took him in the van and the van exploded and Jeffy died in the explosion. Exploded? No, no. 
happened. Jeffy can't be gone. No, he just can't. He can't. He, go, go get Jeffy. He's dead, baby. He's dead. But, but it's he's not Murphy. coming back. He's not coming back. Marvin, no, it can't be real. This is this isn't happening. It's his birthday today. Marvin, no. I know, I know. He died, baby. I know. I should have been nicer to him. I, I just can't believe this is happening. I know. I know. It's I, our baby boy. I know. We should have. I should have been nicer to him. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have been mean to him on his birthday. I'm no, sorry. If, if I had a chance, I'd say sorry. I, I, I wish he was here right now. No, Jeffy. <laughs> oh, man, Simmons, I feel bad. But you must feel way worse, because you fucking suck at shooting. This was entirely your fault. It was a moving target, mate. Gas cap? Tire. Big difference, Simmons. But they're both round. <sighs> okay, Simmons, let's just go. I just wish Jeffy was back. I know, baby. I miss Jeffy, too. <laughs> I wish I could just hear him do that annoying uh, sound one more time. <laughs> Marvin, that was a really good impression. What? That wasn't me. I thought it was you. What? Don't be sad, Danny. It's not like you had to walk 50 miles in the dark getting eaten by mosquitoes on your birthday. What? Well, Jeffy, you're alive! Oh my God! Yeah, I jumped down in the back of the van before it exploded. What? what? Yeah, this is what happened. Uh, hey, we're almost out of gas. Then find the gas station. Uh, With Jeffy, uh, Jeffy, no, Jeffy, Jeffy. Uh, Die, bitch. So that's what happened. Thank God you're home, Jeffy. Yeah, we love you so much, Jeffy. <laughs> well, it's not like every day you kill your mom on your birthday. Well, Jeffy, listen, I know you're 18, but you don't have to move out of the house. You can stay here as long as you want because I can't imagine life without you because I've gotten so used to you. I know I know, I was mad to you today on your birthday, but that was just because I thought we were getting money, but I don't care about the money. I, I just want you, Jeffy. I love you so much. Aww. Well, love you too, Mommy and Daddy, but I didn't plan on going anywhere. <laughs> Who's at the door? Hold on. Hello? Hey. What, what are you doing here? I just wanted to say, I'm sorry. Well, I thought you died. You were driving the van. No, I heard a gunshot and I got scared and jumped out. Uh, hey, we're almost out of gas. Then find the gas station. Uh, well, Jeffy, uh, Jeffy, no, Jeffy, Jeffy. Uh, gunshots, I'm out of here. So, do you accept my apology? Well, get out of here, I don't want to see you ever again. I'll call the cops right now. Who was at the door, Marvin? It was one of the kidnappers. What? I already called the cops. Hey there, you call me? Oh, hey, you're not dead. How the hell did that happen? Oh, listen, listen, one of the kidnappers at the door, he survived. Oh, hey, that means nobody died today. Well, actually, I shot my mom in the face before the van exploded. Oh, okay. Well, with the explosion, there's no trace of the body. So that means no paperwork from me. And that's the best birthday present I could ask for. This video is about me. It should have been called Brooklyn Guy's 45th birthday. No balls, name it that.